What is up guys, Smash Pins here and welcome back to the Subscriber City Challenge! Yay! Whoa! Fireworks! There aren't any fireworks, it's just me. So of course today we are back with five new houses for you. We've decided to skip the rooms idea if you didn't see that last episode because the rooms are just lagging out the server too much. So I want some awesome house suggestions in the comments down below. I've seen a lot of people complaining about their comment not being used and I just want to say like, I use five comments an episode, and I think I get over 10,000 comments per episode. So I just have to choose five from that. I really wish I could include everyone. That's why I'm trying to keep this series going as long as possible, so we can get as many people in this world as possible. But, of course, I can't use every comment on the video, so I'm sorry about that. But you might have a shot. Like, it's a chance. Don't expect to be chosen, but go for it anyway. Leave a comment, you know, just in case I do choose you. And one of those comments, the first of today, comes from Navi Ramirez, who says, Hey Joel, do you think you could make me a giant boombox honey jar or Xbox control, please? That'd be awesome. Thanks, XOX. My in-game name is Milk and Cookies, and I thought the boombox sounded pretty badass. So I'm going to do that. And we're going to put it right in front of this grandfather clock here, facing out towards the sea, of course. So let's get building that. Just know that I have to believe all that I see. All that I see. Okay, so the boombox house is finished. I'm pretty happy with it. I think it looks really good. We've got some music notes above it as well. In front of our grandfather clock and Australian flag. Quite hard to do with the button things, but I think the speakers look pretty good. And we've got all the music notes and it just looks pretty boomboxy. And of course, we've got milk and cookish down here sitting by the door to get into it, which is just empty at the moment with a few lights in it. So, we're going to move on to the second comment of today, which comes from Samo Lingo, and they say, Hey Joel, by the lake, could you please build a lighthouse? And I presume he means this lake here, which is a lovely lake, isn't it? Uh, so, sure thing, in-game name, Spammy MC. I can actually find your character, Sammy, and I'm not sure if it's Sammy as in a boy named Sammy, or a girl named Sammy. So, we're just going to guess that you're a girl, um, and if not, and your skin is a girl, just think of it as you wearing a wig so that's that anyway let's get building the lighthouse which we are going to place screw it let's just place it right here on the edge let's build Okay, so I have finished the lighthouse here for Spammy MC. So here it is. I hope you like it. It's looking out across the water, of course. And there's a little door there so you can get in as well. And obviously nothing inside yet as we are not doing rooms at the moment. I also added this little park in here just to add a little thing to the neighborhood. So nice little park here which looks lovely. And also we've got a road going along here now as well. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty happy with how this place is looking. So we're gonna move on to the third comment of today. And that comes from Spooky Gaming. And they say, can you please build a giant Thor hammer? And if you bring back rooms, a room could be in the hammer bit, preferably blue block. Thanks, Joel. My in-game name is Spook Plays. I get me confused with CPK. Uh, but sure thing, a hammer will be good. So I'm gonna put that just here. I think that'd be pretty cool, so let's get building that. Okay, so I finished Thor's hammer, and I'm pretty happy with this. I used some of the carpenter's block, which probably is why the time locks may look a bit silly, because sometimes it glitches out my Minecraft. But there is Thor's hammer. I'm very happy with that, in fact. I think that looks really cool, especially with all of these angled blocks on it. So thank you for your suggestion, Spooky Plays. And there is space in the future in case we do have some rooms in there. Definitely at least space for one room in there. But yes, we're going to move on to the fourth comment of today. And that comes from Michi Kato. And they say, hey, Joel, could you make me a giant doghouse in game name Michi? And my skin is a nerd girl. So sure thing, I can make you a doghouse. That would be fine by me. 
So we're going to build that over here somewhere. So let's get building. Maybe next to the Grand Fam Clock. Here's a good space. Let's do it. <laughs> So we have finished the dog house and I'm pretty proud of this one as well. We've got a nice little dog bowl here to drink out of if this was a massive dog living in here. But instead, we've got little Michi who's sitting in here. So I hope you like your dog house. We've got a bit of a weird tree there. I'm not sure right there. But you've got the Australian flag. She's looking up at the Australian flag like, oh, interesting. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. That adds to our selection. We've got the boom box, the lighthouse, Foz Hammer and the dog house. So... Let's move on to the final comment of today, which comes from Rene Boz or Rene Bose, Rene Boss. I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm sorry. And they say, can you build me an old school windmill? Here in the Netherlands, we have loads. My in-game name is Blue Knight 07. I have a super buy skin. I'd really like that, Joel. So sure thing, I can do that for you, Rene. And we're going to do it right here uh, next to the boom box. So let's get building it. I just know that I have to believe Oakley, so the windmill is finished and I am super proud of this one. So we got all the crops out front here along with a bit of garden and we got Blue Knight 07 standing in front of it looking lovely. Uh, then we got the entrance over here and yeah it's just a really cool looking windmill. I'm very happy with this one. Probably one of my favourite things I've built so far. I think it looks really cool. So that is that. So to recap we got the boom box today. We've got the almighty lighthouse. We have Thor's hammer. We have the lovely doghouse. And of course, last but definitely not least, we have the beautiful windmill. So yes, guys, that is going to be it for this episode of Subscriber City Challenge. Make sure to leave a like and more importantly, a comment with a suggestion. And let me know what I should build for you. Make sure to leave your in-game name. That is important so I can place you next to your lovely suggested build. And yeah, I'll be back another time for another video. Goodbye. What's up guys, Smashbeans here and welcome back to the Hypixel server where today I am joined by none other than LD Shadow Lady. Welcome, welcome, one and all. <laughs> and today